Howdy y'all, Dawson Strat with Defender Tactical. We're back here today in the lab and we're going to be doing a life cycle test on our universal cartridge adapter for 12 gauge Mossberg pump shotguns. Um, if you're not already aware, this adapter is going to allow you to shoot inch and three quarter mini shells all the way up to three inch shells in the same magazine without changing anything. Um, so what we're gonna be doing is we're going to be loading this up first. The firing pin is removed from this, from this firearm. So we're gonna be loading this up to the full 13 round capacity using mini shells. And then we're going to test run this. This is a relatively new adapter. We've only had um, maybe one or two magazines cycle through this before. Um, so we're going to load it up, do a control test. Then we're going to hook it up to our test rig and try and run it to at least 10,000 cycles or until we see some sort of failure. Um, and then afterwards, if it's still intact, which we're expecting it to be, then we're going to put it back in the gun, um, cycle several different magazine variations and see how it works afterwards. So let's get this loaded up and then we will get on to the testing. Again, the firing pin is removed from this and we are in a safe location. There we go, that is full capacity. So let's just try this real quick. We are clear. Alrighty, so let's get this broken down. We will take the adapter out and get it installed onto our little test rig here. And then we will get the test going. So obviously 10,000 rounds is quite the tall order to load and cycle manually. So the most economical and cheapest option that we could come up with is using this Sawzall here. As you can see, we have it strapped up and um, a shell ready to interface with the adapter, how it would in the receiver. And we have our pitch counter here that's going to get activated every time it goes and does a cycle. So we're just going to plug this in now and let it start to run. Alright guys, we are at 5400 cycles right now, everything is still running great, uh, we're going to keep it going, we're not seeing any signs of failure, so we're going to try and push all the way through the 10,000 and then um, take it off, see if it still works. All right, guys, we are now approaching the 10,000 cycle mark. Uh, things are still looking pretty good. So once we're finished up here, we're going to get it off, inspect it, and get it installed back into the gun and cycle a few magazines through it and check for any performance issues. Alrighty, let's get it off there. Alright, let's go ahead and get this cut out of this test rig here. So upon uh, first glance, it seems to be good. I'm not noticing any sort of stiffness change, hardness change. Um, it seems to be structurally intact. I have a new one here actually that I'll pull it out and compare it to really quickly. So the new one's on the top. Um, the shape appears to have held its shape, uh, feels very similar to this new one. Um, so yeah, I think we're, we're looking at some good results here. Let's go ahead and get this test rig out of the way. And we will load our 590A1 back up. Reposition our camera here. Okay. 
So we'll take our adapter, reinstall it into the 590A1. Alright, now we're first just going to go with the same load that we did the first time around, which is going to be all mini shells with one 3 inch mixed in there somewhere randomly. slugs and buckshot in these minis we got room for just one more right there all right so that's at full capacity with the life cycle tested adapter let's give it a shot all right we are empty that ran good um, so we're going to lay a couple more shells out here, uh, different sizes, mix it up a little bit more, and then we'll run through a couple more magazines, and then that'll be it, guys. All right, now we have inch and three quarter all the way up to three inch, uh, a little bit more of a diversified load here. We're going to be mixing and matching a lot more than we did. <clears throat> Got room for a little bit more in there. That's going to max us out, so let's go for one more. Why not? One more time. All right, guys, that works great. We are very satisfied with the results here. Uh, again, this adapter has been through over 10,000 cycles uh, very quickly. It took us about an hour to run through all of that. Um, so we're very satisfied with these results. We appreciate y'all sticking with us and watching this video. Uh, if you'd like to get your hands on one of these adapters, you can visit www.defendertactical.com. I'll have all our links posted down below, social media, everything else. So uh, thanks again, y'all, for watching. Have a great day.